what's that? What isn't there a quote something about like failure is unmet expectation or something like that? Yeah. Or maybe I don't know, like I don't something know to do with it, that. But something. It sounds good. If not, I'll I'll quote yeah, it. I'll credit you. Exactly. <laughs> I think I think a lot of times that is what it is. It's just our expectations. So I think it's sometimes finding success and failure is just shifting our expectations. And so for me, like I couldn't have written a book if I hadn't gone through a phase I was really stuck. I think like sometimes you find an interesting story through that. And so I think it's important to be open to that and not just totally closed off. Um, but yeah, I think, like I said, for mine, I mean, one failure was feeling like I thought I'd be married at a certain point and that yeah. didn't happen. Knee surgeries, um, some stuff like that, but and just trying to be perfect, like having this really big expectation on myself that I had to be a certain way. <clears throat> And I went I, in the book too, I opened up at the end about going through counseling and that was really good. And that's another mentor of mine, Brock, uh, Brock Frizzle, who's my counselor in the area. And he's been super helpful in just helping me to become more vulnerable and authentic and uh, just not being so hard on myself. Yeah. How do you feel like that, um, that image of perfection played a role in you, like maybe not doing things? Do you think it, it hindered you from starting projects or even a painting? Yeah. And I think it still does sometimes. I think, I think that's maybe a constant, you know, I think maybe we all face is that you have these yeah. expectations. And I think like one of the hardest things about writing a book, or, I mean, you can tell me maybe even starting a podcast, like it's not necessarily the journey. I know it's going to be really hard to do. I know it's like hard to write a book. It's going to take time. It's the worry about what the result's going to be. And so it was like, my biggest fear was what if I write this and no one reads it or I mean, what if I write it and it's not any good? And so I think that's like a definitely a scary thing.